Here are the leaders after the original dance. Angelika Krilova and Oleg Ovsyanikov of Russia. Their nemesis for years. Pasha Grishuk and Yevgeny Platov. And now that Pasha has gone to Hollywood, the road is clear. And this will be another variation on the familiar theme of Carmen by Georges Bizet. <laughs> about this couple is their really fascinating movement. Intricate, difficult, very hard. follow one of the main rules of ice dancing and that's speed speed and then more speed Angelika and Oleg both from Moscow they live and train in Newark Delaware silver medalists at the Olympic Games not the Carmen we're used to. You'll notice also that there's an extreme express expressiveness on her part in particular. Does it work for you? No. I find her absolutely beautiful and fascinating. But as one newspaper said, her expressiveness will reach to the 70th row of the arena. Unfortunately, there's only 30 rows in it. But I find them regal and elegant skaters. This move, quite marvelous. themselves been involved in a number of controversial rulings by judges over the years, most involving Pasha and Yevgeny, the Olympic champions. And Oleg told us the other day he tries not to think about it, but he never wants to be a judge when he gets done skating. Take your eyes off her face. red scarf representing the fact that she has shot him. That's all the story of Carmen is just a little convoluted in telling. One of the things that's so marvelous is her height. That way you get more to see. The leaders heading into the free dance put a somewhat lukewarm reaction from the crowd. And taking the ice next, the French couple, Marina Anasina and Gwendal Pezera, the bronze medalist 
from the Olympics in Nagano. George Balanchine, the great five, choreographer, seven, said he five, liked to see nine, tall skaters because that way you get to five, see more. And this five, couple eight, really epitomizes five, that. Eight, five, seven, Look at these marks. Five, nine, and five, five, seven, and those are very high. Th there's some room in there, though, still just the same. As you would expect, the first five, nine, team in this last five, group, nine, the judges always five, leaving room. It's five nines five, across seven, the board for presentation. Five, nine, five, nine. But Dilova and Oksyanikov take the lead in terms of those that have skated over Punselin and Swallow of the U.S.